Hey, what's going on everybody? So what I have in this bag here is gonna solve my cloudy water issue that I have in my tank here. So after doing just a little bit of research, I've come to the conclusion that this is not my filter stirring up the sand bed here. And it's actually a bacterial bloom. So, I went ahead and bought a UV sterilizer, and that should fix my issue. I've looked at several of them on Amazon, Bulk Resupply, eBay, and just general online. Uh, and I think this is the best one for the money. Let's open it and see what I got. So I went ahead and got the AA Green Killing Machine. This is the 9 watt version and it should fit in my 14 gallon uh, Nuvo Fusion Peninsula tank just fine. It's up to 50 gallons is what this says it'll do. So let's go ahead and hook this up and see if it works. And if you guys want to check out this UV sterilizer that I'm using, I'll go ahead and put a link in the description on the bottom if you want to check that out. Here's the instructions and then just a quick start guide. Little booklet, turn green water into clear water. So you get the little sponge that goes on the unit itself. This part detaches here. So this is the actual UV light itself and how it's designed is it's kind of all encapsulated in here. You can't change the actual light bulb inside here. Once it's Use after six months you just discard of it and you buy a replacement one everything's kind of all together you've got your little power brick here it goes into the wall then you've got your pump and it all just connects to everything and then it's all powered by one plug here I'm gonna go ahead and put this back on here the pump goes right back on here And then this goes on top of here. It's got the suction cups here. You stick it on your glass. The water gets sucked up through here using the pump. And then it comes up the top. And then it spews out the water. Now it's not going to spew the water very quick. It's, I mean, it's, it's a really tiny pump. From some of the other videos I've seen on YouTube, it just kind of drips out. It's not meant to be really quick. And the quicker your water goes through, you know, your UV sterilizer, you know, the less efficient it is. So you want it to kind of, the water to go in here and spend time in here so the light kills the bacteria or whatever kind of pest you have in your tank. Now we've got it hooked up and you can see that's the flow right there. As you can see, I went ahead and added the clownfish. Everything tested out okay. All the parameters are good. So I went ahead and threw these guys in there. But it's clearing up pretty nicely so far. So let's go ahead and wait until the 24 hour mark and we'll see how clear it is then. So this is the 24 hour mark. It doesn't look like it's cleared up too much, but it's slowly getting there, so we'll go ahead and leave this on a little longer and hope that it clears up a little more. This is the 48 hour mark, and as you can see, I went ahead and I didn't take out the UV sterilizer, but I moved it to the actual chamber that the little filter sponge and where you put your carbon at, I went ahead and put it in there. It does seem like it's slowly getting a little more clearer it's not getting as clear as it was like over the first 12 hours but it's slowly getting clearer I may actually put a carbon reactor on here I mean right now I just have a bag of chemical glue in there so it's not really doing it perfectly 
I may put a little carbon reactor on there just kind of see what it does. Run it for a couple days and just see if that clears it up. If not, I may just keep the UV sterilizer on there and it may slowly get better. I don't know. But it's definitely, it's a complete 180 from, you know, day one. Appreciate you guys watching. If you enjoyed this video, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And then whenever the little bell icon pops up, hit all. That way you'll be notified anytime I upload a video in the future. And also, if you like this video, go ahead and hit like. And if you don't like it, go ahead and hit that thumbs down. It lets me know that I need to make better videos. So I appreciate you guys watching. Thank you so much.